The YF-22 incorporates the latest in thrust vectoring technology. Jet engines are pushed along by their exhaust gases. If these are redirected by adjustable nozzles, the tail of the plane can be pushed around much faster. With thrust vectoring, a fighter can change direction more quickly. The YF-22 was expected to dominate the air for 20 years. But there is a rival on the horizon. It also uses thrust vectoring. This plane may be the ultimate fighter of all time. It may even be faster than the YF-22 and is without any doubt more maneuverable in close combat. This is the Sukhoi 37. It looks like any other fighter, but it can perform impossible maneuvers. Fighter aircraft are traditionally fast, but very heavy, which makes them difficult to turn. The Sukhoi 37 can perform heart-stopping maneuvers that defy gravity. For any other fighter, these maneuvers would be well beyond their flight envelope. They would stall and crash. Thrust vectoring and small canard wings on the nose allow the pilot to throw the Su-37 around the skies like an aerobatics plane. Twenty tons of military metal can reverse direction instantly. This amazing agility would give it a decisive edge in combat. On its first public appearance, its pilot issued an open challenge to dogfight against all comers. No one took up the offer. The Sukhoi is master of the skies. But with fighters becoming faster, the pilots are getting left behind. In the search for ever more maneuverable planes, it's the pilots themselves that are now the weak link. <laughs> 